Round one, here we go. This is a fine hand. So we'll keep it. Let's go with the keep here. Yes, okay. Do we need double black or anything or double blue? Yes, <laughs> but I mean like soon? No. Okay, so we're gonna have to make a choice about how to crack this amulet. I think it's gonna be black. Although we have more black sources, so maybe blue is more correct. We'll, we'll figure that out later. Let's play this bad boy. Yes. Manolith. Oh boy, they're gonna ramp into something crazy. Gross. Meow. Alright, we don't have a two drops, so let's do this. Uh, well, I screwed that up. Because I wanted to have a consign up. That's fine. I don't think we're going to consign anything. But, you know, it would have been nice. I'm like, here, let me, let me just tap my lens like a maniac. Alright, so we're on turn four. Five mana. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, well, this looks pretty dang good with the cartouche on it. And we need to land. Okay, an island would be awesome. I will settle for a swamp. Okay, cool. This is not going terribly. But they have a lot of mana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh boy. What? Oh no. Might as well sack the cartouche. <laughs> Cause it's not gonna do anything. Okay. Gross. All right. Five mana. I think we just want to play the Eternal and get to start the Sands next turn. Hold up, consign. Okay, okay. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, 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 okay. Well, we can consign that for now. Me. I'm not real sure how we deal with that permanently. Um, I mean, I guess we can try to make them discard it, but that's not going to happen. Okay. Uh, five mana. I guess we can tragic lesson. Pitch the eternal, I guess. Because I really do want this land. And then... Take your play Zerat. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, cat. Jeez. It's like she knows I'm recording. <laughs> She's like, let me go make some noises. Oh, okay. Two manaliths. Okay. Oh, okay. Yes, this is a crocodile. It's a little less scary than the flying guy, though. Because at least this just gets blocked by rat. Okay. Whoa. Now we just make him discard the other guy, though. <gasps> Cat, jeez, don't push my hand down on the F2 keys. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, yeah, we have to consign. Because then we just make him get rid of the big fatty. Right? 
This is the gr the best time in the world to do this. Wait, 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 wait. Is that what it's called? Oh, com oblivion. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. Well, that kind of worked out. Okay. Cool. Maybe I should have just sent the eternal. I'm going to draw some cards. That's fine. Eventually, I'd like to play the Sphinx. That would be good. Okay, well, we can torment that. It's fine. <gasps> and that is, in fact, an instant. So we can do that and then play Bone Slasher. Okay, so let's attack with the Eternal. Oh, they're just going to block it with the rat, but that's fine. Flick 2 is cool. So yeah, I'm just going to play the Bone Slasher and then Torment the Scrounger. So I don't want them gaining life. Right, right. I wonder if they were in our pod. Cause that bad boy was in our pod. Ambuscade. Oh, okay. I like that with a Torment. <laughs> Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Got him. Got him. Wait, what? Oh. Right, it's a one-way damage spell, but it's still fine. You can't ambuscade my bone slasher. Gain two life from it though. Gross. Gross. Alright, um, I think this is probably just Stir the Sands on this board. It could be a Sphinx, but I, I still think I like Stir the Sands. That's just three bodies they have to deal with. Which seems good. Okay. Um so the clutch card in this game was this bad boy. Okay. I can deal with that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I mean, their deck is decent. That big demon is kind of trouble unless we have the, the removal to deal with it. Like, we just kind of lucked out. Um, Ambuscade's great. I like what they're doing. They have a game plan called ramping our big fatties and just go. <sighs> so, I mean, the feet definitely comes in. Like, no joke. Over what? Over what? I think we want Unburden and this in, because yeah, being able to make them discard is great. What well, looks bad? Um, I mean, Torment of Scarabs, does that even look good? Not only I'm permanent. They have a bunch of, like, other stuff. So they, I mean, they have a bunch of, like, non-creature things, like Manalus. Let me focus here. Sorry. I got distracted for a second. Um, 
Yeah, so unless she's he or she sacrifices an only impermanent or discards a card. So they could get rid of their mana list once they use them for mana. I don't know. I, I still think it's pretty powerful. What is the cut? What well, looks really bad against them? I think everything has a, a purpose in here. This is hard. This is really hard. I'm just, I'm going to cut the floodwaters? Is that insane? I don't know. That might be insane. But I, that's the only thing that's like sticking out as a sore thumb to me. Ooh. That was tough. I think the Ruin Rats are doing good work. Okay, this is fine. They're doing very good work. And they're so cute. Strategic planning. They must have been in our pod. I mean, maybe not, but like, I feel like they were. Mmm. They have so much ramp. It's like insane. I wish this rat was a zombie. Like, then he would just be like ridiculous. Oh, look at that land. Oh. Uh, I think we want the Bone Slasher down. Bone Slasher! Yeah, and then next turn we can play two things? Oh my. Oh my. These walls are looking mighty fine with this desert. Oh, baby. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. All right, so we attack with both. We get in for one. Whee! We play out another rat, and then we play out one of the walls, I think. Although maybe both walls was more correct. Hmm. Because the double ping is pretty real. Mmm, soul stinger. Oh, okay. Gross. Cartouche of knowledge on a bone slasher. Seems good. Let's do that. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Um, oh wait, I can't do that. I don't think we want to play the second desert. We don't need, we don't really need five mana. I think it's nice to be able to cycle it. Okay, yes. Okay, this is great though. <laughs> Termin of Venom. Okay, let me just get rid of the cartouche. <laughs> Seems good. You don't have any attacks, buddy. I can tell you that right now. You don't have an attack. You don't have an attack because I would block with my wall. All right, so let's ping them. Tragic lesson. Sure. Mm, I sort of want the second wall down, actually. Let's, let's cycle this and play our second wall. Ooh, or just tragic lesson. I don't know, having two walls down a turn seems good. No, mm, let's just play the wall. And pass. 
if we attacked with the rat, we would really just be trading uh, two rats for a soul stinger, which I don't really want to do. Okay. Nope. Oh, oh, oh. Let's crack this amulet. Uh, just to thin the deck a little bit. What do you think? I think that's good. Mmm. I don't have a board wipe or anything, right? I think we can stir the sands. Seems good. Seems good. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Boo. You have a cancel? Where'd that come from? Gee, crabies. It's fine. I don't even know if those zombies were gonna do any work anyways. <laughs> uh. Mm-hmm. All right, we can venom that up. Okay, I'm gonna take one because I'm at 20. Like, I feel okay taking one damage from a rat. Unburden. No. They have one card left. I don't think now's the time to unburden. I think we want to probably torment a venom the scrounger, although it just trades for a rat anyway. I'm gonna pass and just hold up the torment. And tragic lessons an instant too. Oh man. Oh baby. It's not time to unburden, so we'll just pass, hold up our instants, see what happens. Okay. Sbring. It's a beautiful card. That looks very peaceful. Oh boy. Oh boy, here we go. Uh, so they have Ambuscade Mana, but that's fine. So I think we just go block. Block? And oh, we don't have to block the rat. Let's just go like this. I actually think we just let them trade. I don't think we use the Torment because it's nice removal or whatever. Ooh, do you have an ambuscade? That might change things. So this is ambuscade, it might change things. It is. Yeah, because I want to keep my wall alive. The walls are like killing them. Called it! I was like, they have ambuscade mana. Oh, baby. Yeah, I would have liked to save this for something else. Like, I would have been happy to let these trade and let them gain life. But they cannot kill my wall. I will not stand for that. This wall is so important to me. It really is, though. Dealing two damage a turn is, like, very important. Oh, okay. That's fine. Let's get rid of the thing that they get to draw cards. No, thank you. Yeah, I don't know if I agree with them killing the rat like that. Uh, can they get things back from the graveyard? I don't know, in case they have like a uh, wander and death or something. I think at this point we, um, Cycle the unburden, but I don't know, maybe not. Consign is nice to have around. Okay, so let's tragic lesson main and see what we get. Discard a card unless you return a land. We can bounce a land. 
and then we can torment. Seems good. Pay us. Okay, so they got rid of the Manolith, which is good. That keeps them off the demon if they have it. But it's still fine. We're in a decent place right now. Okay, Ritualist is fine. Yeah, they send the rat. Sorry, buddy, I'm gonna keep taking one from you. I'm not scared yet. Kona Rally wins is nice. Oh, baby, that's nice. All right, so. What do you think their last card is? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's some bird. What do you got over there? I would like to know. And then yeah, whatever they draw, we can counter. We're in a really good spot. Ooh, baby. <gasps> the concede. Dun, dun, dun. Sweet. Okay. Um, I think their deck was decent, which gives me hope that our deck actually might be pretty good. I was nervous because I just thought we need more flyers and stuff, but we actually have a pretty controlling, beautiful, nice deck. I, I, I like it so far. I don't love it, but I like it. So we'll see. All right. That was pretty cool. Um, See if we can keep up this pace. I'll see you in a little bit. Thanks for watching.